Hey guys, Michael B. The Game Genie here, and we've got some big pre-order news to share with you this evening as there's news coming out of the Arcade One Up camp about their big cabinet coming out this summer, with big being the predominant word, talking about Shaquille O'Neal with the Shaq NBA Jam XL Edition. So we've got details on when you can place your pre-order and how much it'll be. Also, we've got some details on when you can place your pre-order in Canada, where and how much it'll be as well. On top of that, Speaking of Canadians, we've also got some other news for those Canadian customers like myself that have been looking at the Air Cave one up webpage, seeing that Dragon's Lair cabinet there for pre-order and salivating, but knowing if we placed our pre-order, we're going to get hit with massive duties and taxes. There is now a pre-order option up for us in Canada where we can get it directly at retail and avoid all those costs. Let's talk about it right after this. Hey everybody, thank you so much for tuning into the video. I didn't anticipate making a second video today, but news broke about the NBA Jam Shack Edition that I thought I would want to share with everybody, especially since I got some information as well on the Canadian release, and that means a lot to me being a big Arcade One Up fan from Canada. On top of that, we got some news on Dragon's Lair today for Canadian fans as well of Arcade One Up, and I just wanted to share it with you. So no, I'm not making two videos today because I have bills to pay or anything like that. It's just news that's come out, and I'm excited to share it with you. First off, let's talk about the NBA Jam XL Shack Edition. Now, I, I've been very vocal about this. I'm not in love with this cabinet. Uh, this is even before I saw the issues with the screen going on with Golden Tee and wondering if that was going to happen with the Shack NBA Jam as well. But what I didn't like about it was I love when Arcade One Up does a recreation of the original cabinet. And they've taken some liberties here to apply the Shaq branding to the NBA Jam cabinet. And it's just not my jam. If this was a NBA Jam XL cabinet that recreated the original cabinet, we'd be having a different conversation now. But since we're not, NBA Jam XL Shaq Edition is coming up and going on pre-order soon. A website came out of nowhere today and released some pre-order information, and I'm going to share that with you right now. So the website Gaming Trend put a news post up today. Arcade One Up's NBA Jam Shack Edition will be available for pre-order on May 2nd. Uh, that's actually a lot earlier than when I thought when the Gamefly leaks came out. It looked like it was going to go up for pre-order in June, but it looks like it's going to be May 2nd after all. Arcade 1UP has teamed up with the legendary Shaquille O'Neal to create NBA Jam Shack Edition, which will be available for pre-order on May 2nd, 2022. You know what's wild? This cabinet's almost six feet tall, and look at Shaq just towering over it like it's the basic uh, Arcade 1UP three-quarter scale cabinets without the riser this edition of nba jam is 67 inches tall without the need for a riser and features a 19 inch lcd screen uh, you can read the details below we've already gone into massive details about it look how tall this massive man is and look at the cabinet now me personally i dog on the cabinet all the time uh, i'm just devastated with the fact that they didn't use the original art instead we've got a white shack image on the side instead of the classic nba jam logo you've got no coin doors molded coin doors which are so beautiful on the front you've got the shaquille o'neal image anyways there it is so uh it's coming out on may 2nd for pre-order but from what i am estimating right now i believe that it's only going to be available on uh, in, uh arcade one up direct so don't expect to see this at retailers right away if this does go up for pre-order may 2nd as is being reported by gaming trend right now expect it only to be on arcade one up direct for a limited period of time that's because I got a little tiny bit of information today kind of leaked to me accidentally that the cabinet may in fact be available direct for uh, May 2nd but it may hit retailers somewhere around May 4th, May 5th, and I, in fact, know that the Canadian price is going to be roughly around the same, and by roughly, I mean exactly the same as Golden T XL 3D right now. So, let me show you guys. So guys, if you head on over to the Bricks website, you can take a look at the Golden T 3D XL cabinet, which is available now at the brick in fact i went there earlier today 
and uh, they had one in stock and it took everything in my power to just force myself to walk out without buying it. But you can head on over to the brick right now and check out the Golden Tee 3D XL cabinet. The reason why this is important is because from what I understand, the NBA Jam XL uh XL cabinet is going to be exactly the same price, $899.95 Canadian. So for those of you wondering what the price point was going to be, it's going to match the price point for the XL cabinet Golden D 3D Golf. I think it's pretty safe to assume if that's the case in Canada, you can expect the same thing in the U.S. So expect for, I believe it was $599 or $699 U.S. I can't remember. So $6.99 US will be the price point for NBA Jam XL if you're interested in picking it up. Speaking of Canadian consumers, many of you, much like me, have been looking at that RK 1UP Dragon's Lair and absolutely drooling wanting to place a pre-order direct, but Canadian consumers have a little bit of a problem with doing that because the shipping is ridiculously high to here in Canada, especially where I'm to. I think it's going to cost me an additional $120 to get the cabinet shipped to my door from direct. Then on top of that, I'm going to have to pay additional taxes, additional duties. It's going to cost me like $1,300 by the time it's all done. So even though I, I, I'm just dying here to place my pre-order and so excited watching everybody place theirs, I can't and I have to wait for a retail option. Well, luckily that retail option presented itself today. So guys, that's right. If you head on over to the brick, we finally have a retail, let alone any option to pick up the RK 1UP Dragon's Lair cabinet here in Canada while avoiding duty and shipping and we just have to pay our taxes like normal. Thank you so much to the brick who I believe, if I'm not mistaken, may have exclusivity to this cabinet here in Canada this time around, much like they did with the Golden Axe cabinet here in Canada. So very, very cool. We can place our pre-orders and add this amazing recreation of the original cabinet in the three-quarter scale from our cave one up to our collections one of the cool things to mention here is if you take a look in the back box even though down here it says secondary lcd screen our cave one up have actually fixed that uh, they fixed the information on their main page this is a secondary alphanumeric screen so bring your own screen is gone not only did they uh, go back and actually get a second screen but they actually sourced the original screen that was in the original arcade which is an alphanumeric screen and they put it up there for us to use so very very cool job arcade one up like i said many times this is the arcade one up cabinet that i i just i could not pass on it was announced so very long ago ces not last year but the year before we're finally getting it and i'm so excited that i don't have to order it direct i don't have to get hit with shipping and duty charges extra i can just order it from the brick which i plan to do shortly so guys, very exciting pre-order news for both the NBA Jam Shack Edition for people who want those. $8.99 here in Canada, $6.99 in the U.S. May 2nd if you want to order directly from rk1up.com. Looks like retail partners are going to be able to help us out somewhere around the 5th. So if you're in the States, you can look for your favorite retailer here in Canada. Check them out. Check out the brick. I'm sure it'll be up somewhere around that date. And of course, Dragon's Lair Finally, we have an option to buy it here in Canada, avoid duty and shipping, and just pick it up normally, save a couple dollars, and you can go to the brick today and place your order. I'll leave a link down in the description below if you want to do that. But last but not least, there is one other thing I want to talk about this evening. You guys know I'm a huge fan of the uh, RK 1UP marquees. They've got to be illuminated, and uh, I get so much shit because I say the marquees aren't that bad, and people are like, no, no, they're terrible, they're washed out. Some really are, especially the darker ones. Like, my X-Men marquee is absolutely brutal, and I've never gone for um, an aftermarket marquee because I want to keep the marquee as stock as humanly possible well we finally have a really cool simple solution that i saw yesterday on facebook that i wanted to bring to your attention so i'm sure anybody that's involved in any kind of our home arcade business or anything would know the name joe zabo but zabo's arcades have come out with a very clever invention here which is actually a slip-on marquee cover where they can apply their graphics with the highest quality all the details of the original marquee and you actually just place it 
over your light box and it kind of clips in. I don't know if they've included the video here, but I'll go down through the pictures. That's how the final product looks. I'm a little unsure with this one because Outrun is actually a bigger marquee, so I don't know what's going on there. Uh, our, uh, that was a strange choice. There's the Turtles in Time one, and from everything I've seen, that marquee is terrible this definitely needs it uh there's killer instinct this is one um, my killer instincts okay looking but it doesn't of course have the nintendo logo or the midway logo so i might or it, maybe it does have the midway logo i don't think that's one i might jump on he showed a video for it. it it's actually incredibly cool basically all it is it's just a slight pressure you tear off the sticker on your original light box marquee you place this one over the front of it and the pressure applies it in and then you just screw your marquee back in easy peasy. I've always been hesitant to jump on getting a third party marquee because I don't want to lose the structure of the wooden bar inside the light box marquee that Arcade 1UP has and they always give you like these weird screws that aren't real. I'm concerned about not doing it right. This is just an amazing option to just cover over the original marquee. You don't have to worry about getting a new sticker and applying it. The one thing I will say I'm a little shy on is the price point of $50 US. I mean, you're halfway to a brand new marquee at that point um, from rk1up.com direct. So the price point seems a little high, but it is a very, very cool option. I, I don't know. Maybe that $50 is Canadian. I'm not 100% sure. We always get this weird thing here in Canada where sometimes it adjusts the prices, but $50, if that is the price US, seems a little high, but I just, I just think this is such a cool option for people looking for better quality marquees on their rk1ups and your like me and you don't want to go with something that's a little bit flimsier you want to keep the structure original cabinet this is just such a smart thing to do way to go joe zabo anyways guys that's it for me today <laughs> i swear i don't think i'm gonna make any more videos so exciting times if you're interested in the nba jam shack edition pre-orders are coming up soon get out there place your orders and get your nba jam shack editions as you make your way to building your new arcades that are full of xl and pro cabinets for me personally i'm super excited about the dragon's lair option here in canada this is the one arcade one-up cabinet i cannot miss this year i'm gonna place my pre-order uh, probably after we finish this video and then of course for people that are looking for marquee changes you want to get rid of some of your more washed out arcade one-up marquees that maybe necessarily they dropped the ball on go check out joe zabo he's got these great pressure slip on marquees they look fantastic and everybody knows joe zabo's quality his name is synonymous in the home arcade and regular arcade space man knows what he's doing anyways guys let me know in the comments what you think of all this stuff are you going to be placing pre-orders for any of this stuff are you gonna are you a canadian that's excited about the dragon's lair news and last but not least are you gonna be getting a new marquee from joe zabo and if you bought something from him before leave some comments leave some stuff in the comments uh comments <laughs> leave your stuff <laughs> Oh my God, leave your experience with Joe Zabo's products in the comments for other people to see so they know how good his work is. Wow. <laughs> Anyways, guys, hope you guys have a fantastic evening. This is Michael B. The Game Genie, and I'll talk to you next time.